Hey guys, it's Alice again and welcome to day three of my daily university uploads. If you don't already know, I'm uploading every single day this week and I'm doing it all relating to universities. So I'm preparing you guys who are off to uni for the first time or just going back in second year or just being a little bit nosy like I probably would have been doing when I was a little bit younger. So I really, really hope you enjoy these videos. If you aren't subscribed to my channel, make sure you press the big red subscribe button and you won't miss out. And also give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it because that'll mean a lot to me. I don't know what this was. So then, today's video is actually a tag video and this is a tag I have created myself. Or at least I like to think so. There's probably something like this somewhere in the world of YouTube that I haven't actually come across but I don't think there's anything like this out there. So I thought I'd create a tag and challenge you guys who are also at uni or have been to uni to answer these questions too. So basically this is the university tag and I have gathered a selection of questions to answer and I'm tagging everyone who is watching this right now to make your own video or answer the questions in the comments and let's make it a thing, you know? I like tag videos and I feel like we need a new one in our lives so I've got them written on my phone, let's get going. Question number one, where do you study? I study at the University of Lincoln. Question number two, what do you study? I study media production and I gotta say, I really like it. I love it a lot. Question number three is, what year are you in? I am going into second year, so I've just completed freshers. It is now the beginning of September and I'll be starting second year on the 26th and kind of scared, not gonna lie, but I'm very excited because I get to live in a house this year and it's gonna be so exciting. Watch out for future house tours coming because that's gonna happen and I'm excited. Question number four, do you live at home or at uni? Kind of just answered that question, haven't I? I live at uni, I come home every two weeks and I really enjoy it. I never ever thought I would want to live away at uni. I never even want to go to uni. That's a whole other story, but I'll tell you that one day if you want to hear it. But yeah, I live at uni and I absolutely love it. It's definitely scary at first, but I'm so excited to get back and like be in control of my life again. I just can't wait. Next question is, how old are you? And I am 21. I thought I would add this question in because I know before I started, I started two years later than everyone and I thought I was gonna be really old, but actually it turns out there are a lot of students at uni who are actually classed as mature students like me. I'm a mature student and there's no need to feel out of place basically so I thought it was nice to keep that question in. The next question is what are your three uni essentials? I'm not going to answer this because I literally did a video on Monday about like things to take to uni so plugging myself here but you can go and watch that. <laughs> next question is what is your favourite meal to cook? Ooh, this is hard. I love anything with chicken in but in terms of being easy, probably like Tesco sell packs of chicken that have already been coated and stuff and it's like two for £10 and then some rice or McCain's oven chips are amazing. So probably chicken and chips, simple, basic, but tastes delicious. Mmm, I'm making myself hungry. Next question is, what is the latest you've been to the library? I thought this was a fun question to include because I know a lot of people have long night stays in the library and I actually haven't been in the library that late. The latest I went there was because I had taken out a book and I hadn't returned it on time and I'd got a fine so I rushed back to the library at like 11 p.m. one day to avoid getting more fine. Other than that I don't think I've been in the library past probably 4 p.m. I just refuse to do that. I can't work in the library. I work a lot better at home and I know some people are the other way around. Next question is ever done an all-nighter to finish work? I can happily say I haven't and I think this is because I'm super duper organised and I get really stressed out when work isn't done so I've usually finished my work at least a week before the deadline so I am not that person who panic does the work and I'm really glad about it actually because it stressed me out way too much. <laughs> what is your favourite university moment so far? Oh my god I can't remember this. The one thing that's just jumped to my mind was um, going to the Christmas market with Izzy like that was obviously near Christmas and I lived in two flats last year if you don't already know I lived in a flat that I didn't really get along with the people in there so I moved out and we went to the Christmas market and at this point I still lived in the horrible flat and I was, was not happy and we were on the ferris wheel and we I was just like so content and it was so cute and happy I'd probably say that's one of the best moments it was just so nice to be with my friend and having a good time and yeah, I'd say it definitely picked up after I moved out of that flat and 
just any night with my course mates um, was a great night. There's so many great things that happen. I literally can't pick one, but that one definitely stands out the most. One piece of advice for a fresher. Ooh, okay. Again, I've done a video on this. It's called How to Survive Freshers, and it's it was probably about two months ago, so you can find it if you want like a big detailed thing. But an advice for a fresher. I'd say don't just follow the crowd. Like, if you don't want to go out, don't go out. If you don't want to do something, you don't have to. Like, just don't feel pressured by it. Peer pressure is the most annoying thing ever. And luckily, I'm quite a stubborn person. So it's really hard to pressure me into doing anything. But I'd say just do you. Don't let anyone pressure you into doing anything. Don't let anyone take you for granted. And just be yourself. Have a great time. And do you. Next question is name something that you were worried about for no reason. So this question was actually Izzy's idea and it's just a tip to let you know not to worry. So something I was really worried about was making friends because I'm not the most sociable of people. I'm really awkward. I just never know. I just don't know how to small talk. I'm rubbish. I'm really, really bad. Um, so making friends was definitely a scary part for me before I got there. But it was so easy, like, it's weird because everyone's in the same situation and it is a little bit awkward at first because no one wants to talk to each other, but then after, like, two weeks maybe, everyone in the lesson knows each other, you're all having a great time, you're all taking the mess out of each other. Taking the mess, that's a Yorkshire thing, isn't it? Taking the piss is probably, that's what I meant by that. Um, and, yeah, I just feel like making friends is gonna be a whole lot easier than you think it is and you've probably been told this a lot of times and you probably don't believe anyone but honestly hand on heart making friends is genuinely so easy and it's great when you actually find a really nice group of friends hold on to that and make sure you spend as much time with them as possible because that's what university is all about to be honest and the final question is are you or did you enjoy your time at university my answer to that is yes I wasn't enjoying it so much in the beginning like I briefly mentioned but now I've got my flat sorted and I'm going into a house and I've got myself a group of friends that I really do trust and love and we all love each other and we all support each other and I'm just so happy so even though my very spontaneous decision to go to university was not planned whatsoever yes I am so so happy about going to uni and I'm enjoying it so much and I know it's just gonna get 10 times better and I cannot wait. So that is it for my little university tag video. I'm gonna write all the questions down in the description. So if you wanna make your own video or if you wanna answer the questions in the comments, you can do. Let's share this around. Let's see if we can learn some more about our fellow university friends. There's a lot of us out here and I feel like we don't share enough about ourselves and make friends on here. So let's make friends with some uni students. That's what I wanna do. Thank you so, so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it give it a huge thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you aren't already because I'm uploading every day this week like I've told you a million times and yeah I love you a lot and I'll see you tomorrow bye today's video is actually university life hacks and these are a few things that I have done myself or have searched online and found and will be using in the next year and I know they will come in so so handy